little while ago, and I have, I have never, never, ever met a more loving, generous soul in my life. She is truly one of the most beautiful people on the planet. Ms. Rose Henry, it is my privilege, it is my privilege to present you with the Distinguished Community Change Advocate Award. So deserving to you. God bless you. <laughs> Rosie's award reads, in recognition of your self-sacrificial disposition, work, and fierce advocacy, organizing and providing support for marginalized communities as she sought to ensure ensure them to live up to their true potential and to assure their rightful place in the world. Awards ceremony committee. Again, it is my privilege, my great, great privilege to present the Distinguished Community Leadership Award to a true rose, a beautiful rose, Ms. Rose Henry. Thank you very much. I greatly appreciate it. Can you guys hear me? No. Okay. Okay. I want to greet each and every one of you in the name of Jesus. Without him, I could not do all of this. So I have to give him the praise and glory. I remember when I was called and was told that I would be honored and they're going to give me. Oh my goodness, I'm so emotional. I'm so sorry. Anyway, I did not want to accept because I've been doing this, not letting a lot of people know what I'm doing. I'll quietly do it, give, and people who have been helping me, they are the only persons who know about what I'm doing. So I'm going to humbly accept this award. And I want to thank Westchester United Methodist Church, Reverend Edward, of course, Sandra, she convinced me. <laughs> Thank you. Taj and everyone else who made this possible. I am so happy. I am very happy in what I'm doing. I'm a servant for the Lord. I'm not doing this because I want someone to say, oh, Rosie is doing this. I'm doing it because I'm very happy doing this. It doesn't matter what we have in life. If we don't share, we don't, I, I, actually I can speak for myself. I don't, I don't get joy and happiness. So for me, it's just to do what I can do and I'm gonna ask each and every one, you don't have to give to my charity, but just give to someone. And I'm asking everyone who I've done something for, don't give it back to me, just pass it on. Just pass it on because at the end of the day, we are all just passing through. Yeah. And it's going to be that day, we're not going to be here anymore. And I want this to be my legacy, that when I'm gone, people will remember Rosie, what Rosie did. And if anyone can follow that, do that, okay? Yeah. Oh Lord, I'm so grateful to you. And I want to thank a couple of my donors, such as Central Caribbean Bakery is on Gunny Road, Dumpling Cove, the Cove in, in Queens, and of course, I'm going to have to thank Rich Genius. I will be having a fish fry next week, Saturday. He made it possible. He gave me the place, he printed the tickets, and he will be the DJ. And I want to thank all the other persons who are donating whatever they are, they are donating, because this project that we're having the fish fry, this, I'm sorry, next Saturday, is to build a home, which you didn't show on the video. Oh, yes, you did. We will be building that, another home for this lady. She is blind and she's bedridden. How oh, I met this lady, I went to Jamaica in January because we distribute food to 19 to 25 people each month. I don't know these people. I have people in Jamaica who would call me and tell me about these people or they video these people and send it to me. So we feed 19 to 25 people each month. And when I went on to Jamaica, I said, okay, I'm going to go down there and I want to do this myself. 
And I met this lady, and when I saw this lady, she cannot walk, she's blind, and she's living in that shed that you just saw. So I decided that I'm going to build her a one room with a bathroom, kitchen, and thank God we started the project. So with this fish fry next Saturday, by the grace of God, it will be finished. Because I believe I walk in faith, not by sight. So by the grace of God, I give it by August, we will be finished with that project. And whatever else comes, we will do it. So I want to thank all of you, all of you. Okay, I have a few people I have to say thank you to, like Tracy, Stacy, Frenchie, Althea, Chris, my beautiful children. I'm doing the fish fry, as I said, on Saturday, and my son is flying in from San Diego just to come to support me. Another person I have to give her a shout out, I invited her and she had a trip to go to England and she called me this afternoon to tell me she will be coming back just for the fish fry to support me. And I want to thank all those people because again, it brings so much joy to my heart. God bless all of you. Thanks a million. That's it. Thank you.